What's up, guys? We're standing here outside the Lehigh Township Police Department. This officer the other day uh, stopped me, told me I was being detained at a DUI checkpoint, told me I was being charged with a crime and refused to identify himself. He eventually did let me go and didn't charge me with anything, but uh, it's a real issue when an officer refuses to identify themselves. Hey, you doing? I am here to file a complaint against an officer, and I need to identify this officer. Do you know who this is? Uh, he does not work for us. He, he doesn't work for Lehigh Township. Well, he... Could you, could, you, could you stop filming me? I'm not a police officer. Um, oh, you're, you're you work know for right. the public. You can't videotape me here. Uh, well, I'm sorry, but the law... Talk to the chief of police. If you want to wait outside, I'll, I'll call him and he'll come and talk to This him. is actually a publicly funded building, and I'm here to file... That's that's not that doesn't. We were at the checkpoint the other night. If you want to talk to that of the officers, you were there too. I want to know who this officer is who refused to identify himself. He doesn't work for Lehigh Township Police. I can tell you that much. Can you tell me who he is? No, I'm not telling you who he is. You're not telling me who are you? Who am I? My name is Matt Enstrom. I'm a detective here for the police department. Matt Enstrom, and and you're unaware of the laws that say we are allowed to film inside public. That's fine. But if you want to wait out in the parking lot, I will call Chief Fogel and he will come out and talk to you and address the situation, okay? So we can't wait inside? Not if you're going to sit here with cameras and film us, no. Could you please the station? Alright, thanks. Well, we'll be right back. Chief will be right back. Alright. Can I have that officer's badge number? Number nine. Badge number nine. Okay, um, I came through your checkpoint the other night. Mm -hmm. This officer, okay, they're telling me he does not work here. He yes. identified himself as a Lehigh Township police officer. No, he's, he's part of the DUI task force with Lehigh Township. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. What we do is we have other officers from other departments that assist with the details. Which department should I go to? Then? Uh, he's with Bushkill. Bushkill Township? Correct. Can you identify him for me? Uh, that's up to them to give you his information. I'm not going to release his information. Plus, our DUI task force director is not here today either. So I have a legitimate complaint. They told me I was being charged with a crime. Okay. They told me I was detained right. at the checkpoint. And then right. he, he did not charge me with a crime. He did not. From my understanding, is there were citations filed uh, for you, and it was regarding not displaying and not producing your photo ID card or driver's license. Okay, well, let's. Uh, they were filed through this department? Uh, yeah, they would be filed through this department. You'd get those in the mail. All right, well, let's clear those up right now. Well, you have to wait till you get them in the mail and respond to them accordingly to this report. There's nothing here to clear up at this department. Well, uh, actually, within 72 hours of a checkpoint, you can produce your paperwork and have the charges dropped. Okay, That's well, Pennsylvania law. Okay, well, you'll get them in the mail. You can respond to them appropriately when you get them in the mail when they're I'll filed. be more than happy to give you my paperwork right okay. now. Well, it's not going to do me any good because they get filed through district court, not through the police department. That's the way the rules of criminal procedure work in Pennsylvania. We don't take any pleas or anything on tickets are you at the police station. Are you aware that a DUI checkpoint is legal in Pennsylvania, but a Absolutely. license checkpoint is not legal? In That's not what we're doing. But, okay, but I'm being cited for not producing okay. my driver's license. What I'm going to tell you is that and actually, the checkpoint, hold on, actually, hold on, you, want, you asked me a okay. question and I'm going to explain it to you, okay? The checkpoint is done in accordance with all the laws and regulations that are set forth in Pennsylvania. Now, if you want to contest the citations, you are more than welcome to do that through district court of course after would. you receive them in the mail. That's really as much as I have to tell you about it. Okay, well, if you'd like to give me your information, I'll make a photocopy and I'll give it to the officer for you. And then you can address that when the hearing date comes up. You Which officer? Come up for that. Lehigh Township did file them. Uh, one of the officers from Lehigh Township would have filed it, but the other officer would have been the witness for the case of why... Uh, I'm actually, I have video of that officer telling me I'll be cited if I don't leave right away. But, well, I can't speak so, to any of that because I wasn't on that part of the line, so I don't Well, know. I can show you the video. I, I'm not interested in looking at your video right now. That's so So I don't well, know. I can show you the video. I, I'm not interested in looking at your video right now. That's something that you would deal with down in court, okay? That's not something that I can address with you right now. Okay, and if you have a complaint to make regarding that, you know, there's other avenues that you can certainly do that if you feel that you need to. Um, yeah, I'd like to file a complaint against, uh, I guess it would be this officer then, who is Lehigh Township. He identified himself. I don't, I have to watch the video again to, um... It's awfully dark, but yeah, okay, I know who he is. Sure. He, he's, can you, 
Can you identify him? He uh, not, not right out here. I'm not going to. If you would like to make a complaint, you have, on. if you would like to make a complaint, there's paperwork that you can fill out to make a complaint. The secretary can give you that. You're not permitted to record inside the station, though. Got that? Understand? Uh, actually, no. Okay, but I, you can't. I, 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 if you want, I can grab the statute. I'm not interested. Car. If you want to go in and get a complaint form, you may get a complaint form. That's it. Or if you want to wait out here, Lord, I'll bring it out will to not you. stop rolling. That's, That's fine. Would you like me to bring a complaint form out to you? Um, actually, this is a tax. Taxes are Do you live in Leah Township? It doesn't matter. Yeah, it does. No, it doesn't. Okay. Do you want a complaint form? You still haven't answered my question. Do you want a complaint form? I would like to come in and sit down and file a complaint form, yes. Okay, you can fill out a complaint form and you may bring it back when you're done. I'm not going to sit here and wait for you to complete it. I do not have the time to do that. Any other questions? Yeah, you don't think it's a little uh, retaliatory to file charges against somebody who's just simply exercising their rights? Look, if you violated something that they cited you for, you violated something that they cited you for. Now, if you produce your stuff, yeah, but you admitted your Hold on, hold on. If you submit your stuff in accordance with the law, then that'll be addressed down at district court. Is that the district court right around the that corner? That is correct. Yes. So oh, uh, sure it's probably already there, the charges, correct? That I don't know. Depends on how long it takes for it to get from basically the network here to his office. Okay. Um, I know it happens pretty quick, so it could be. So if we stop there, maybe we can take care of it all the way to that. You might be able to be able to if it's there. You might be able to enter. Are you paper. are you able to look up and see exactly what the charges were? It was just not producing paperwork, or did they go charge something else as well? Uh, my understanding is it's those particular sections that pertain to not uh, providing identification, driver's license, registration, insurance. One of one of those, if not all three. I'm not sure. It's all three. And you know, Pennsylvania law says I have to be involved in a traffic stop to be required. Okay, well, well, again, those are arguments. The chief of police, I'm sure again, you those are arguments to make at district court at the hearing. Well, I'm um, talking in general. Okay, well, again, if you know, one of your officers, I don't have, to I don't out. have, I don't have a vehicle code and crimes code book sitting in front of me right now to sit there and, and go line by line with you about that. I, I actually do with the car. Okay, so but I'm not going to debate you on the issue right here, right now. If you want to, want to debate it, that's what district court is for. Okay, that's what the hearing is going to take place. For. Okay. All right. Well, I go by Severn Freeman. My uh, organization mm -hmm. is Lehigh Valley Cop Block. Mm -hmm. We are we are uh, very strong on exercising our rights and okay. very strong on uh, educating people on what their rights sure. are. So, I mean, as an officer, you're used to taking a uphold and defend our rights. Certainly. It was one last night. Where was it? It was right uh, on the south side in front of uh, Steel Stacks. One of your department thought that they were pretty cute by uh, making a false profile on Facebook and coming onto our page and telling us that there was a checkpoint in Banger to try to throw us off from this one. You guys stand like Marines, or former Marines, both of you. No? You? You know, your state constitution requires you to answer questions of the public officer? You understand that? You remember your oath? Yeah. Put your camera on. Is it rolling? Yeah. Well, Officer Peacock here, I've had an encounter with him before. Just school him on his oath, man. Peacock, is it? Yeah, it's Officer Peacock. He, uh, I came to a scene of uh, them about to tow away somebody's car for having an expired, expired license, and I tried to assist, but he wouldn't hand the keys back over. I said, I'll, I'll be more than happy. I was on the scene. I said, I'll be more than happy to drive this car away right now. Hey, hon, can you hold this for me? Stop. 
is uh, JP Freeman from King Cobla Cobla Dono. This is Officer Peacock. He doesn't like to answer questions in the uh, press or the public. That's pretty cool. Thank you. What's not cool is uh, officers actually violating the rules by not answering questions in the public. Yeah, I always. Well, I don't answer every question. Oh, well, well, maybe it's a prejudice issue. Hey, uh, I don't have anything better to do. I'm one of Carlos's guys, man, from down in Miami. Nice. Good to meet you, man. Good seeing you. I'm with uh, Cop Block, New Jersey. Nice. Uh, I'm uh, Lehigh Valley Cop Block. Uh, nice to meet you, man. You can direct it to me. I serve to 20 years in the U.S. Navy. Okay, so I do have a thing benefit to do. Thank you for your service. Appreciate it. All right? Don't thank me for being a murderer. All right? Four legs in Iraq in five and a half years. He's happy in handcuffs. No, we can't. I'll sue him. Yes, sir. Yeah, you don't waste your time, but you're sitting here guarding a gun of water. Is your name with you before we have to? Oh, I'm wasting my time. He doesn't waste his time. I'll tell you what, go fight crime. Coward. Cowards don't answer questions. Have a nice day. I'm nice not going to have a nice day knowing that you're wearing a badge, man. Until that badge is off, I'm not going to have a nice day. Okay, test that. Because I think you're a coward. Okay, test I would sky through your things, bro. And I'm 40 years old and I run circles around you, bro. Okay? What's he doing to you? What are you He's not answering questions. Your state constitution, your state constitution requires him to answer questions. Any. He's, he's subject to public scrutiny. That's, that's in your constitution. You're a public officer. Ask the question. I already did. You won't answer. You won't answer. What's the question? I said, why don't you, or why don't you, go out and fight crime instead of guarding the sideline? There he was. He's, he's holding it up for us. You know, I, I talked to five cops, all of them are great, except for you. I don't like you. It's not because you're a cop. I know you don't care. It's obvious you don't care. It's obvious. You're a hat. Thank you. I'm working on it.